Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to disable the sticky or filter key pop-up dialog windows you're getting on your Windows computer. You know, we're playing a video game or something on the computer, and we get this little sticky keys pop-up that asks if you want to turn on sticky keys. So we always answer no, but then it comes back a little later and then it'll keep coming back. So it's just a never ending cycle of the pop up and then you selecting no. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve it. So if you're curious, number one, how you actually receive it, it usually will pop up if you hit the shift key five times in a row within very short interval amount of time. So in order to disable this, we're going to jump into it and start by opening up the start menu. And you want to type in control panel. Best match should come back with control panel. You want to left click on that one time to open it up. Now you want to go and make sure your view by is set to category view up in the top right. If it's set to large or small icons, you want to set it to category view. And then select ease of access down here. So now once you are on here, you want to go and left click on where it says ease of access center. So I'm actually going to uncheck these two options because I don't want it to be reading out loud while I'm on it. But we want to scroll down to where it says make the keyboard easier to use. So left click on that. So now once we are here, you're going to see that we want to turn off the boxes for turn on sticky keys or turn on filter keys or turned off. So make sure both of these boxes are unchecked. So while these are both not active, it does not mean the pop-up is not going to come up and disturb you. So in order to do that, we're going to have to resolve it by clicking on set up filter keys or set up sticky keys. So select one of these. I would just select the set up sticky keys right here. Now you want to just check where it says turn on sticky keys when shift is pressed five times. Uncheck this box here. Once you've done that, you want to left click on apply and OK. Now you want to go and left click on set up filter keys same process you want to uncheck the box where it says turn on filter keys when right shift is pressed for eight seconds so we're just going to turn this off both of them we don't want either one of them to be popping up on us and once you've done that just left click on OK and that's pretty much it so at this point just close out of here it doesn't matter how many times you click on shift or you trigger the filter key it should not be disturbing you so I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out and as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.